वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 6.76 सो स्टेटमेंट इज डिटरमाइन द मोमेंट एम दैट कैन बी अप्लाइड टू द बीम इन ऑर्डर टू क्रिएट अ मैक्सिमम स्ट्रेस ऑफ 80 मेगा पास्कल आल्सो स्केच द स्ट्रेस डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ओवर द क्रॉस सेक्शन सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द क्रॉस सेक्शन ऑफ द बीम एंड द मोमेंट एम इज अप्लाइड अबाउट न्यूट्रल एक्सिस क्लियर एंड व्हाट वी आर गिवन वी आर गिवन विद द maximum stress of 80 mega pascal so you have to find this moment m that can be applied to the beam and after finding that sketch the distribution acting over the cross section so let's start with the solution so as we know that maximum stress is equal to m into c divided by i we do not have m we have the cross section of this beam so we will first find the moment of inertia so the moment of inertia which is represented as i and this i is equal to we will take this we will first find the moment of inertia of this whole square cross section that is of 300 by total 300 clear this is 300 260 plus 20 plus 20 and then we will subtract this the moment of inertia of these two hollow rectangular section so we know that moment of inertia is equal to 1 over 12 bh cube when this formula is applied when neutral axis passes through a centroid so we will use this formula so i will write it 1 over 12 bh cube so 1 over 12 its breadth is total 300 mm so in meter it is 0.3 and h cube which is also 0.3 meter so 0.3 whole cube minus 1 over 12 now what is the width of this so total is 300 so if you subtract 390 uh, minus 300 because this is 30 30 30 which is 90 so 300 minus uh, 90 is 200 and we have two equal portions so we will divide it by 2 so it will be equal to 105 okay so this is 105 mm and this height is 260 mm so i will write minus 1 over 12 into uh, 105 which is 0.105 into height is 0.260 cube clear so we and we will multiply it with 2 because we have two hollow section one is this and second one is this so again when you solve this you will get i will be equal to 0.36742 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter power 4 so this is the moment of inertia now what about c so c is the maximum distance from neutral axis to the top most clear this is the value of c and from here you can see the total height is 300 so c will be 300 divided by 2 mm 150 mm and in meter c is equal to 0.15 Zero, so C is zero point one five zero meter. Now you have maximum bending stress that is given as eighty mega pascal, so eighty into ten to the power six pascal. Okay, eighty mega pascal. Now you have all the values, so you we know that maximum bending stress is equal to m into C divided by I, so maximum bending stress is 80 into 10 to the power 6. We do not have M. We are going to find it. C is 0.150 divided by I, which is 0.36742 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter power 4. Okay, so when you solve this, you will get. This moment comes out to be one ninety five point nine six into ten to the power three newton into meter. Or this moment is equal to one ninety six 
किलो न्यूटन इंटू मीटर सो दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ मूवमेंट दैट इज अप्लाइड ऑन दिस क्रॉस सेक्शन सो इफ वी रिप्रेजेंट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ओवर हेयर सो आई विल रिमूव ऑल दिस वी विल शो यू द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन आई विल चूज अ सॉलिड कलर फॉर एग्जाम्पल सो दिस इज द मूमेंट एम दैट इज वन नाइन्टी सिक्स किलो न्यूटन सो इफ यू लुक यू विल हैव मैक्सिमम बैंडिंग स्ट्रेस एट द टॉप सो वी विल ज्वाइन दैम एंड एट न्यूट्रल एक्सिस यू विल मैक्सिमम बैंडिंग स्ट्रेस विल बी बैंडिंग स्ट्रेस विल बी जीरो सो यू विल हैविंग दिस Similarly, on bottom you will have a maximum stress like this, and at neutral axis it will be zero. So the bending stress variation will be shown. Now you can see that up due to this movement the beam will bend like this. So. the upper portion will be in compression so your bending stress will be like this one it will be in compression while the lower one will be in tension and the stress distribution will be like this and it will be zero at this point similarly we will represent it like this the same case will be here now you can see that uh, if i draw over all picture so due to a stress a force will be like this and here the force will be like this and this will produce a movement about x is like this and this is the movement which is 196. 196 newton into meter so this was all about problem 6.76 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest video if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching